It's been quite a morning, already emotional. As you can see, the wall is now set up. It's such a potent display. So many people already stopping by, even as we wait for an opening ceremony at one o'clock. It arrived in Durham at eight this morning in cases on a flatbed, escorted by those nearly 80 riders from state and local police and the New Hampshire Patriot Guard riders. The procession moved through town and back around to campus and under the American flag held up on ladders by the Durham Fire Department. The wall making its way here to the lawn of Demerit Hall, where it was assembled with the help of riders and veterans, most of whom knew someone whose name is on the wall. There were people from my platoon that, that got killed over there, people from my, my platoon and boot camp that didn't come back. It's an honor and a privilege, and we never forget our fallen brothers and sisters. Opening ceremonies are open at 1 o'clock. Then after that, it's 24 hours a day, public viewing until it actually leaves Durham Monday morning at 8, headed to May. We're live in Durham, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.